now let us discuss about realization or implementation of half adder using nand gate uh, we know the expression for the sum as well as carry for the half adder uh, sum is equal to sum is equal to uh, a exclusive or b let the inputs are a and b whereas carry is equal to a into b so now we have to design the half adder we have to design a circuit for the half adder by using with only nand gates only so in this video we are focusing only on the nand gates in the next video we will see about uh, how to implement half adder using with uh, another universal gate called nor gate okay uh, here uh, uh, we require totally yeah this is the first nand gate we require a structure like this and this is the second nand gate for the sum operation we require uh, five nand gates like this so one two three four nand gates four we require a structure like this so for the first nand gates the inputs are a and b whereas second nand gate receives input from one input from a and other input from output of the first nand gate okay next third nand gate receives input from one input from b and second input from the output of the first nand gate the output of the first nand gate first nand gate and next fourth nand gate receives input from the output of the second nand gate as well as output of the third nand gate so this is nothing but the expression for the sum what is the expression for the sum a exclusive or b this is the expression and for the carry uh, first let us evaluate this expression uh, here what is the output of the first nand gate uh, a b whole bar a b whole bar uh, and let us uh, uh, write the diagram for the carry also let us make the connection uh, we know that a b whole bar is nothing but a b here what is carry a b so we have to pass this as input to the another one more nand gate here for this nand gate we have only one input so we have to write like this if there is only one input then we have to write like this okay so now what will happen uh, a b whole bar only one input a b whole bar is nothing but what a b so this is nothing but a b okay so there is no need to evaluate carry so directly we will get the carry now let us evaluate sum okay uh, let us focus on this nand gate uh, one input from a another input from a b whole bar so we can write this as a b whole bar a into what is b a b bar whole bar and let us write for this one one input from b and another input from a b bar so we can write as a b whole bar so a means b and b means what a b bar so b into a b bar whole bar okay uh, next uh, this nand gate receives input from uh, these two nand gates okay a b whole bar so what is a a means a into a b bar a bar this is a whereas what is b b means b into a b bar whole bar a b whole bar so for this one we have to write the bar okay now let us evaluate this equation whether we are getting a exclusive or b let us see that one so this is in the form of a b whole bar so this is a this is b we know the formula for the a b whole bar what is the formula for a b whole bar a bar plus b bar here what is a a means a into a b bar whole bar a into a b bar whole bar this is a next we have to write bar so bar plus what is b b means b into a b bar whole bar bar so let us write the bar we know the formula a b bar whole bar is equal to a a bar whole bar is equal to a okay so here we have a bar whole bar so we can write this as a into a b bar so this is in the form of, form of a bar whole bar so we can write as b into a b bar so this is we can write this as 
a into a b bar plus b into a b bar. So we know the formula for a b whole bar, a bar plus b bar. Okay. So we can write this as a b whole bar as a bar plus b bar plus b into. We can write this as a bar plus b bar. So let us multiply this one. A into a bar plus a into b bar plus. Let us multiply b with these two terms. B into a bar plus b into b bar. A into a bar is nothing but zero. Plus a b bar plus b a bar can be written as a bar b plus b into b bar is nothing but zero. So a b bar plus a bar b is nothing but a exclusive r b. Okay. So this is nothing but sum. Okay. So how many NAND gates are required here in order to implement the half header? So one, two, three, four, five. So five NAND gates are required. So in this way we can implement half header with the help of NAND gates only. In the next video we will see about how to implement half header with the help of the another universal gate called NOR gate.